Hi guys. Today we are back with another glue book with me episode, page, whatever you want to call it. I'm doing another one of Heather's prompts and the prompts this week or this time are felt, gold, glue, a wild card, lace, and a punch. Now I don't actually have felt so I just picked out a piece of fabric and I'll cut that up and uh, glue it down. For the gold, I chose, I don't have very many gold things, but uh, I have these gold pieces of paper and some gold, um, some gold like uh, decorations, I guess, on some things. I don't really know if you can tell, but it is gold. And some gold on the pink. There's gold on here. So I don't know. I probably won't use all of these gold things. But I just. I got a bunch of them out. Because I wasn't really sure. What I wanted to use. Um, the glue. Obviously this is a glue book. I will be gluing everything down. This is another gold piece. Um, the lace. I don't think I'm going to use this crochet lace. I, I like it. But I don't know how well. It will glue down in the glue book. So I'm just going to leave that. So I have this purple lace here and uh, this strip of white lace. I got these from um, the thrift store. So I'll cut those and glue those down as needed. And then for my wild card, I chose money because I have a lot of this play money stuff. So I just chose a couple, couple bills and I'll glue those down. So I think what I'm going to do... Is I actually don't have very much for backgrounds, do I? Might be using a lot of this fabric. Hopefully not, because I don't really want that much weight on my in my book. I mean, it's not really it's not heavy weight, but still. So we'll have some money right there, some money right there, and then I'll I'll do something with that. And I think I'll use. Probably both of these um, gold sheets. Put that there. And this one up here. And I definitely want to use the fabric in the center so I'll probably cut a, a strip a decent sized strip to glue down in the center of it and I might use well I will definitely use my tacky glue for that so let's just get a strip cut out first So we got this, and obviously it needs cut to size, so about right here. So we got this extra piece, so that's definitely going right there, and then this dollar can go above it. That one I think is going to stay right there, and... Maybe I'll put this, life doesn't have to be perfect to be wonderful. I'll put that card over here and I'll glue it. I'll have it be a pocket so I can stick some of these other cards in it. And then this one, I'll glue down fully underneath it. About like that. So glue that down, glue this down, glue the, those down. And this money, we'll put this put this 10,000 right there and then put this 1,000 right here so we got that and then I have these golden pieces I can put them right there put that right there fits perfectly right there and 
Oh yeah, and punches. Punches was, I got this whole thing of punches, so I'll, I'll glue some of these down at the end. But what I think I'm going to do is have another strip of fabric right there, and then um, these things, these four Project Life cards with nothing on the back of them, I think I'll pick definitely this pink one because that, I love that one. And then Beautiful New Day. I like the colors on that one. So those will be the cards that I stick into this pocket. And maybe I'll even glue another piece of fabric like over here. And then let's see. Definitely doesn't need to be this, this uh, wide. And it's not going to be that wide. I just want to make sure that I get it, get this area covered. And I cut it too short, of course. So we use this one. And I'm not going to cover up this. I just, so really, I just need to cut it about right here. So those will be, get glued down first before anything the two pieces of fabric and then the money and these things and then that and then the lace I'll just just you know use strips of it here and there don't really care for this purple stuff which is why I'm trying to use it so we can put like a piece of lace right there can even put a piece of lace on here somehow I got some blue paint on there put some lace right there honestly I think I can make the lace be a little belly band and put another card inside of the belly no no actually I'm not gonna do that because this is a glue book and it will be opening and closing a lot and I don't want it sliding out so never mind about that And then the rest will be, um, I'll add some punches on it. So let's make sure I got the, the fake felt gold, the, the glue that I'll be using for this glue, rather, um, lace and punch. Yep, that sounds good to me. Okay, I'm going to get this glue down and then I will come back. So I'll see you in a second. Okay, I am back and everything is glued down. I have my pocket with my beautiful new day and my pink gold cards. I might as well just put these in there too because I don't really have any other purpose for them. Maybe I could put one right here. Maybe another little pocket, but I don't know what I would put in it. Um, let's do these three actually. Yeah, we'll have these three right here um, I'm not going to leave them in here I just wanted to show you that it is in fact a pocket because I don't want them to accidentally get glued down so while this page is drying I'll leave them out but once they're dry then I will put them back in so now all we have to do is pick out some punches so here's ooh this is gold this side I like this side a little bit better but this side's gold so We'll put that right there. And I have a little heart that I got in Happy Mail. Some little circles. <laughs> and some flowers. Lots of little flowers. And here's an arrow use an arrow I don't have any punches so all of these were sent to me in happy mail at some point point. and how about a cat just a plain old cat I need some more room oh I like that flower and here's some 
does that say? Traditions. And this one says, oh, this one doesn't say anything. It's got a cardinal on it. And how about a snowflake and a leaf? And I think that will be good enough. And if I need more, then obviously I'll pick out some more. But for now, I'm going to go with those and see how it looks. This isn't really sticking down very well on the edge right here. Probably because my book is nowhere near flat, but that's all right. I like it like that. You may not like your books chunky. A lot of people don't, I know that, but I do. I definitely don't mind a chunky journal. Now this is a composition book. I might have to take some of the pages out. I don't know. I, um, I, I should, I should say that I should take some pages out and I know that I should take some pages out, but I kind of want to see how well it will hold up. I'm kind of torn. I don't know. What do you guys think? Have you ever done a composition book like this where it got so bulky? Like, this is how bulky this is. And this is only, this is not that many actual spreads. I still have a ton of paper left in this. And there's definitely uh, pages that I could take out in the center. I could take out like five or ten pages and this would still be a great book. But... You know, it, it, like, if I got that far and the book did not fall apart, I would kind of be... It's funny because I would kind of be upset that the book didn't fall apart because I took out all those pages. I could have had more pages to work on. But at the same time, the reason the book may not have fallen apart at that moment is because I took those pages out. So, I don't know. I'm just having fun playing with it right now, so I haven't decided anything. We'll see how it gets once I get a little bit closer to the center and where I'm going to really need to start thinking about taking some pages out. Oh, a little tiny blue heart fell out too. That matches that gold. I'm actually going to use the, the blue side of the heart since I'm using the gold side of that circle. So this page is turning out good. Really all of my pages have turned out good. I really am liking doing the glue book thing. Sorry, my nose it just started running. I think because I sneezed right before I turned the camera back on. So we got a couple more things to glue down, and that is going to get stayed right there. I'm going to glue that on that. Well, this is going to... Oh, wait. Yeah, that is that is actually gold, even though it's kind of hard to tell. It's gold. At least I am considering it gold. And now all I have left is a circle, a flower, and a heart. So, let's put this circle right there. We'll put this heart, I mean this flower, right here. And then I have this heart that was made out of a map. And I'll put that right there. Perfect. And that is my finished collage using prompts from heather at craft and share with heather her channel will be linked down below if you want to go check her out she does a lot of cool things a lot of um prompt games she's been doing lately and i have been i followed along with with two of them so far and perhaps there will be more in the future so i hope that you enjoyed watching me do this glue book page and i hope that you like it and hope that you like the video as well. And please leave your comments and subscribe if you're not subscribed. And share me with your friends. 
and I will see you in the next video. Bye.